Hi guys, it's I'm Miffy Les and I'm back again. So today I'm here to do another product review slash demo and first impression. Yes, I pick up the Sleek Rockstar collection. I so I've been having this product lying down now in the house for a couple of days just because I wasn't feeling really good. I was feeling kind of sick. The weather is getting really cold and I was feeling kind of sick. So today I feel much more better. If I am talking to you guys with my nose stuck or I'm doing like all those crazy actions, please excuse me. I'm sick, okay? So I pick up this um, sleek uh, rockstar collection and I use it to put this look together and I hope you guys like it so first the, the palette they have like two different palettes but I couldn't lay my hand on the one that I really wanted so I pick up this one and the palette comes like this. It, it, it has a plastic where you have all the names of the palette but my beautiful daughter when I first received the palette, when I opened it to like watch, she just grabbed the plastic and I couldn't find it. But if you guys look on, on, on YouTube or other videos, you guys can see the names. But this is what this palette looked like. I really, really like the color. So this is what I used today to create this look. I really like it and I'm going to do like a um, swatch for you guys. So we're going to start from this green. And I have no primer on my hands okay because this is just bare skin we're gonna start from here I don't know the names but I hope you guys will bear me my daughter she is so so beautiful and she just destroyed the name okay if you guys have kids you definitely understand what I'm talking about so this is what this green look like on my skin tone it has no no um I'm just going to do it on my skin and show you guys. I have no primer on my skin. So, yeah, this is just barely skin. And you guys know my skin is... For somebody who are like my skin color, can they can have a little bit of idea of what the color looks like. I'm just going to... um apply this and then see how it goes they're really really nice color I really really like them but I wanted to have the other palettes but yeah guess you can't have everything eh? no you can't really have everything I wanted to have the other palette because that was the one that I was more into so this is what the color look like on my skin we start from the green to all the way to the white silver color this is what it looks like on my skin I really really like it um, you guys can see what it looks like this is what it looks on my skin I really really like this um, this eyeshadow especially the, the golden one the golden one do, can't really tell on my skin because it's like gold brown so that's what it looks like on my skin I'm gonna wipe this one off so if you are like somebody who wants it and you are having like the same skin color as mine you guys can tell and now we are going to the highlighter the high liquid highlighter are a little bit tricky they are a little bit kind of tricky just because I'm not they dry really really fast if you put it in your skin you have to blend so first we're going to take this golden um, shade I'm just gonna use my finger but the highlighter are really really pigment I've already wiped. okay I'm gonna do it like here I've already wiped my eyeshadows but you guys can see the highlighter are really really pigment this is what it looks like on my skin it's like really goldy kind of thing I really really like it you have to close it immediately when you open it because if not that it's gonna get dry and now we're going to try I'm gonna swatch this other color it looks like a rosy road like a I don't know how to call it rose gold or something I don't really know you guys can see it's really beautiful I, I didn't use this one so yeah we're going to take that one as well just a little bit and put it right next to this color you guys can see what this is the gold one and this is like the rose gold kind of color this is what it looks like I really really like it I'm more I'm much more in love with the gold um the gold one and that's what I use as a highlight so it's a little bit tricky I don't I didn't use that much just because I'm not so really good with um, 
cream highlighters i use this like under my foundation but when it comes to use it to like highlight my face they dry really really fast so i'm not really that good at it but i really like it so now we go into the lipstick i am already wearing this um purple shade this is the one you guys can see it yeah it's the name i'm already wearing this and this is the color i'm wearing at the when i was doing my makeup i show you guys how I, how i i swatch both lipsticks so you guys can see how both lipstick look like if you want to if you want to know just check the end of the video and i really really like the way it looks this is how it looks like and this other color really looks really really beautiful yeah I, you know, I like makeup. I like sleek makeup because I like the sleek and early girl makeup. I like it very, very much because they're really, really affordable and they're really easy for me to lay my hands on. Like, I live in a really small village. We don't have any store here that sell makeup for my skin tone except the Hema. So I order most of my makeup online and the sleek and the early girl makeup, they are the most easy makeup for me to lay my hands on. But like if you guys live in a big city like in Rotterdam, Amsterdam, like in a big city, you guys can lay your hands on those makeup really quick. I live in a really small village and I'm not the kind of person that actually travel for makeup. I don't know I don't really travel all the way out to go and get makeup so this is the makeup look and I really really like that they're really affordable I'll put the link below of where I got this makeup and I will put all the name of the makeup in the in the description box and I'll yeah I hope you guys like this video if you guys like this video please don't forget to like comment subscribe and share and don't forget to follow me on my social media on my Instagram because there's that the Instagram and it's where I'm more active like I'm not a Twitter kind of person I don't really, I'm not, I'm not really with Twitter, tweeting, no. Instagram, if you guys want to follow me, follow me on Instagram. That is, I'm more active on Instagram. I'll put all the links below. This is your girl, I'm I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share for more future videos. Peace out. Bye. As you guys can see, this is the look that I'm going for. So what I'm going to do, I'm first going to start with concealer. That concealer is going to act like an eye base for me. So, because I don't have a transition color on my sleek makeup palette, I'm going to use the sleek contour kit. I'm going to use this brown as a transition color. Just a little bit. And it matched my skin perfect, so it's not like a big deal. I'm going to put that all over my eyelid. So that's it and now what I'm going to use I'm going to use that sleek um, blush blush palette I'm going to use blush palette I'm going to use this um, color here to this is the color I'm going to use right here like to blend I really like this color so and I like the way it looks on my skin. So now that I'm done with that, I'm going to take my sleek um Art shadow palette this this is the color that I have I'm going to use this gold color I I had a card where there was a name of all the eyeshadow but my beautiful daughter take it and now I don't know where it is I'm gonna take that gold color and put it right on my eyes like there You're gonna try to build it up. So now that you don't with that, I'm going to take this color here and I'm going to put it in the inner corner of my eyes like there. I 
and put it just a little bit on top of that gold just a little bit I'm gonna take that same brush that I use and just try to blend it out try to smoothen everything going in back with that gold and just build it up like build that gold up you're gonna have to like some shed but that's not a problem you can actually clean it up after you're done with your makeup take a little bit of that red and then now I'm going to just blend everything So now that I'm done blending, I'm going to take my highlighter by Sleek. As you guys know, I'm not really that good with highlighter, so pardon me. So that's it. So what I like to do is I always go in with a concealer and try to clean the excess makeup and just get my eye my eyeliner in place. Take my Real Technique sponge and just blend that out. So now I'm done with the eyes. What I'm going to do is, I've already primed my face. I use the Sleek um, Face Primer. I've already done that so now what I'm going to do I'm going to take this um, hi highlighter palette by Sleek I'm going to take this golden color and put it on the top of my eyebrow like that You're going to use your finger to blend that. Yeah. Use your finger to blend. So after done with that, just because I don't have, I've already um, primed my face, like I told you guys, I've already color correct. I'm going to take my sleek um, concealer stick. I'm going to use this to concealer. I normally use this like a foundation. I'm going to blend this to concealer together as a foundation. It looks kind of red on my skin but when I'm done you guys will definitely see the result. This concealer, I try to use it as a concealer but it doesn't work for my skin. Like a concealer, it melts really easy and it doesn't look really nice as a concealer. So. I blend this two color to get um, to use as a foundation. When I use as a foundation, it comes. It's really really nice. But as a concealer, it doesn't really looks really good. I try to focus more on my face and on my forehead. I just take the excess and just apply that. So now what I'm going to do? I'm going to take my real technique. Um, foundation brush and I'm going to spray it with a fix plus and I'm just going to blend that into my skin
I'm just going to take that XX um, brush, uh, the foundation on the brush and just apply that on my skin. I don't really use a lot of foundation so I don't like it when it looks like I have too much. I like it to be uh, just normal, you know. I like it to look a little bit normal. So I'm going to take that, just get on my problem areas and just build it up. Yeah. So this is how it looks, as you guys can see. So now what I like to do is, I like to take my Real Technique sponge, damp it a little bit, and just go and blend my face, just to soften it up, to take every harsh line out of my face. I definitely have a foundation but it doesn't look like I have too much and that's what I like whenever I'm wearing makeup I don't want it to look like I have too much on if it looks like my natural skin doesn't really look like I have a lot of foundation so now what I'm going to do I'm going to use the Elegant concealer and conceal and So I'm going to use my V7 mini sponge and blend my concealer. I have made video about this one and so far I'm really loving it. I've been using this now all the time to like blend my concealer right under my eyes just because I find it to be very very better like it gets right on the points like right on the places where I need it today I'm not going to use um cream contour I'm going to use um powder contour so that's it's also better So now that I'm done that, I'm going to use my Vic 7 Banana Powder and set my face. So now that we are leaving that to set, you're going to use your contour palette by Sleek. I'm going to use this brown that I use on my eyes. I'm going to use that to like shape my face like right there.
right there. So now that I'm done, I'm going to leave this one to set and I'll be back to show you guys the finished result. So now I have wiped my powder off. I'm going to take this blush from Sleek. I'm going to put that right here. I like to always bring my blush just a little bit on my contour. So now I've put, I'm going to put a little bit of this color just to tone down the color of the blush a little bit because my eyes is already the same color as the as the blush. So I'm going to put this other color just to tone it down a little bit. So now that I'm done with that, we're going to use I'm going to use this highlighter this liquid highlighter from the rockstar collection i put a name on the screen because the names are kind of a little bit tricky to pronounce don't want to mispronounce something so i put a name on the screen and i'm going to use my real technique sponge um brush sorry i'm going to start just little by little because it is a liquid highlighter it's a little bit tricky so just gonna take the brush and like this and then just just a little bit I'm a little bit scared wow can you guys see that okay gotta blend this one quick before it gets dry okay Can you guys see? I don't want to put too much just because I'm scared. But it's, it is really, really nice color. I really like it. I don't know if the camera can pick up the pigment. But it is really pigment. And I just don't want to put too much. I'm just scared of putting too much but I really like the way it looks and you guys see that glow I'm gonna take a little bit on my finger and just get the bridge of my nose can you guys see that a little bit under to my nose just a little bit uh, is your finger to blend it? For me, I think it's when you use your finger to blend it, it's much, much more nicer than using the brush. Because when it it dry really quickly, I don't know if if I'm the only one, but it it feels like as soon as you put it on the skin, you have to you have to blend it. I like to bring my highlighter just a little bit there. I really like the way it feels, so gotta close it immediately that it doesn't get dried. And now, now we're done. I really, really like the way it looks. And now we're going to look to we're going back to lipstick. You have two lipstick. Like this is their lipstick collection from the rocks that you have too. Um, I'm going to try both of them so you guys can see how both of them look. I'm going to try both of them and I really like the way it's shaped. It has this diamond, like a, like a diamond. So I'm going to try that one first. I...
Wow. The color is really, really pigment. I really like the color, to be honest. I'll write the name on the screen which one I'm using. Can you guys see? And this is what it looks like. The color is really, really pigment. I really, really like the color. So now, you guys see what this one looks like. Just because I really want to try this um, purple shade. I want to see how this one looks on me. So we're going to wipe this one off. You're going to take your makeup wipe. And wipe it off. And just, I want to try the other purple color. But the color of this lipstick, they're really, really pigment. I think this color would be too much if I just put this color because of my eyeshadow. It would just be too much. So, I would love to try the purple color. And it is very easy to come out. Like, okay, I just applied it and I have to remove it immediately. But it's not that difficult to take up so we're gonna apply this color we're gonna apply this color and it has the same goldy like a diamond thing kind of shape I really really like this like I like purple color purple is like one of my favorite color uh, this one also have the same pigment It really gives you that rock star feeling like very very pigment I really really like it Yeah, I like this color. I really like it. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to spray my face with a six with a fix plus, excuse me. And I'll be back to show you guys the finished result. So stay tuned. So this is the finished result. I hope you guys like this video. If you guys like this video, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share for more future videos. And yeah, so far so good. I really like it. And this is your girl Amy Fullest. Peace out. Bye.